so here it has been told to find the relationship in between a and b so that the function f defined by f of x equal to this is continuous at x equal to 3. So the function f of x is defined as ax plus 1 if x is less than or equal to 3 and it is defined as bx plus 3 if x is greater than 3. So now therefore if the function f of x is continuous is continuous at x equal to 3 then it means we should have that limit extends to 3 f of x that should be equal to f of 3. So now f of 3 is how much? So so when x is equal to 3 I should use the definition ax plus 1. So that will be 3a plus 1. And that should be equal to the right hand limit of the function at x equal to 3. It means that will be limit x tends to 3 plus slightly more than 3 f of x. So that should be equal to limit h tends to 0 f of 3 plus h. So slightly more than 3. So we should use the second definition. So it should be limit h tends to 0 f of Okay, limit h tends to 0, then it should be b into 3 plus h. Since it is bx, in place of x, I should put 3 plus h. So, b into 3 plus h plus 3. So, now here, if I put h equal to 0, that will be 3b plus 3. 3b plus 3. So, now, therefore, f of 3 is 3a plus 1. So, now, therefore, if f of x is continuous, if of x is continuous at x equal to 3, then it means, it means that 3b plus 3, that should be equal to 3a plus 1. So, therefore, it should be 3a should be equal to 3a plus 2. 3b should, 3a should be equal to 3b plus 2. Sorry. This should be 3a that should be equal to 3b plus 2, yes. Or we can write that a should be equal to b plus 2 by 3. This should be the required relationship in between a and b. So, this is the final answer. Thank you.